What's going on guys? Welcome to another episode of Scale Factor. Today we're bringing you the scoop. This is an excellent move to get away from pressure in tight space. Uh, you will see players like Messi, Ronaldo, Neymar use this. And uh, it's just a very creative move that defenders do not expect and that is very hard to defend. All right, so with this move, I want to wait until the defender is fairly close to me. And this is especially a good one to do if the defender is like diving in at speed. And I want to make sure I have space behind me and I'm going to scoop the, def uh, the ball of the defender and I'm just going to run into that space. The reason why this is such a good move is it's, it's kind of tricky to defend, right? Because even if he lifts his leg up, it's still kind of hard to get, right? Because you're scooping over him. He can't really move his body. He can't use his hand. So it's a, it's a hard move to defend, and it's a really effective move to defend. Obviously, you just have to pull it off. But this is such an underutilized move, in my opinion. I think I think every player should be able to pull this off. But uh, definitely something that we use. Make sure to just, after you do the scoop, make sure to just really accelerate to get to the ball really quickly and, uh, and uh, get your pass in or your dribble in after. So the other thing about this move is that it's much easier to do it from a standing position if the ball is like still than it is to do when the ball is moving. It's still possible to do when the ball is moving, but much easier to like stop and then scoop as opposed to run and scoop. But to do the run and scoop, you just kind of have to practice a lot. Uh, make sure that you're very accurate with it. But it's a good move. I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Leave a thumbs up if you did. And I'll see you in the next one.